Hello, welcome to part 3 of this uh, Let's Play of Mega Man X a series of games. I'm doing some old school games. First off, please in the comments below leave a suggestion for the next game you'd like to see. Uh, also check out the comments below for a link to, um, to the playlist for all these games uh, so you can check out part 1 part 2 and that. Uh, I've got all the bosses defeated now except for this chameleon guy. And I think I might go back and try and get up with some percent as well. I get a chance. I'm sure he must be missing someone else though. Because I remember a bit of a stage where there's this really strange jump. Boomerang! I've never got the boomerang guy. What item did I just get off the. Ah, it must have been this, this air thing. Let's try that out. Epic! A bit wasteful, maybe, but. You know. I like it. It doesn't seem to cost much energy. Oh, I remember this now. Yes. I think I should have come here a long time ago. What do I do here? Leap of fate? Oh! What a leap of fate! Okay, I think I know what to do now, though. Don't break the, the blocks below me. I can jump off them. That's a difficult one. Like, you know, I've not seen a spot like that where it's... You don't, if you don't make this, you die. Alright. Maybe I've got an item that... No, I don't have those boomerang items yet. Well, I'm gonna try and just break the bottom one too. That way I can jump off one of these top ones. Let's see how far I can get. Ah, I don't think that's... I think it's best to go from the bottom. Ah, plenty of room. Wait, that now means uh, my health mate here is higher than my item here. So who knows... Uh, who knows how many there is. Oh. Doesn't look like anything's gonna keep me safe through here. I was saying Leaf Shield a few times there. Now that I think about it, I think Leaf Shield is from Mega Man 2. I feel like I want to check. There's <laughs> lots of these parts. For any more secrets. What about that one? That one looks like it's going down. Oh, I think this is the stage, as I said in the last video, that there's some sort of secret uh, If I go up somewhere, there's um, an extra boss to fight. Dude, one cool, dude. Does it look like I can get below there? Ah, come on. Obviously, we run out of health. I haven't found... I didn't find anywhere that was some extra area. Maybe I'm... I'm mistaken. That can get us some ice, though. No. Maybe down here. It's, uh... Will I just die if I get to the bottom? No. Alright, I'll just go fight this boss. Um, well, well, I think we'll go with homing missiles. I don't think that's... They've, they've been very successful against anyone yet.
Yeah, I want to say no. No, this is a uh, like boomerang uh, beat this guy, and I don't even know where to get boomerangs. Flame should be him though. He's made out of fucking leaves. Come on. Ow. Give a win. This leaves deal with wind all the time. I'll, I'll stick with a homing missile just because it's convenient. Yeah, that's it. If you knock him off, you can knock him off with boomerangs every time. Crap. I'm gonna be doing well to survive this. Oh, I don't have anything in my sub tank either. <laughs> Am I able to just choose not to come back to this stage? I'd like to go get that boomerang before I come back. Um, there's no way to just act. Oh, here we go. Escape. Yeah, there's no way to escape. I think until you beat in the game the first time or beat the boss the first time. Oh well, we'll fight him anyway, and if we fail, we continue to fail, we'll just, once we continue, once we get to the continue point, we will just, uh, fight another boss. Oh, that tongue. I think I was better off with the homing missiles. I wasn't that much better off though. Ugh. He's so difficult. Um, should I try jumping on the walls? Oh, I think there's spikes on the roof means I don't want to get too close to them. Looks like spikes anyway. Yeah, if I stay... What happens if I jump into the roof? Mostly pain. Not instant death, though. <laughs> Come on! Oh, I, I can't. I can't be anywhere close to him. See, he, uh, he cloaks, or it will hurt way too much. I'm not sure if there's anything I can do to avoid those roof spikes. Strikes me as uh, a little too random or a little too fast to avoid. So we'll just have to try fight in a different stage. And I hope I don't have to redo uh, any secrets. So who am I missing? Ah, I keep mixing. I thought these were the same stage. Air and looks like air as well, doesn't it? Storm Eagle, Boomerang. Here we go. I've not fought this Boomerang guy. I wish they were like a big extra to them to kill them. That'd help you figure out some stuff. Ah, okay, this is the stage with the big jump in it as well. But it's the only stage left, it must be. No, well, let's just go ahead and... And use this wind to kill everything.
Yeah, no thanks. I'll just go about my business. Uh, this is easy. I love this weapon. Now there's some secret about you hit the spikes in the wall, you become vulnerable, and you can just not move the rest of the stage. But I tried it out once years ago and I couldn't figure it out. I think that if you maybe it's if you let those enemies hit you, then it doesn't matter what the spikes do. If you stay within range of the spikes, you're set. Now, I think there's a jump here that the, the speedrunner's called Iceless. Because you have to... I'll try and show it to you in a moment, actually. I'm not going to be able to do it, but I'll try and show, describe it. And this this wind, uh, wind gun causes quite a lot of lag. But it's worth it. Right, here's the jump here. Um, well, I'm not going to be able to use the... I can't power up the ice gun yet. So, uh, you are able to theoretically jump from the edge here and catch onto that. It's just really difficult to do. So the proper way to do it is actually to... Um, well, one way to do it is power up the ice gun, so it adds a little ledge, I think. But then the much easier way is to get the boomerang from the end of the stage. And then just come back to it. So that's what we'll do. We'll come back to that. Oh, come on! I can't do the easy bit. Like, this is just jumping. Nothing was shooting at me. <laughs> a bit of an overkill, this weapon is. For most of these guys. Right, who am I facing here? Boomerang. Um, maybe he's homing missiles. I don't think anyone's been homing missiles yet. It's gotta be someone, right? Right, that, that looks like it's doing extra damage. Yeah, there we go. That's looking like an easy fight. Oh, he keeps te he is teleporting then. Does nothing to the homing missiles. I love that. There's no better feeling in life than fighting Mega Man boss with you know his weakness. Okay, we need to come back to this stage to get that um, item there. And we also need to defeat one more stage. What well, if I defeat all the stages? They might um, they might not allow me to come back. So I think I should return to the stages I haven't I haven't got everything on yet. First. But I think I can exit the stage is a little early. Let's see what we get. We got a boomerang shot. Alright, right, let's try and do this nice and quick. Yeah, I don't really care about taking damage to be honest. I should worry about picking up health though to uh, refill these, um, what are they called, energy packs. But I guess my own health has to be full before I can do that. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Let's hope I survive this. Survive the last time though, so maybe I should worry. I think the damage they're doing me is actually helping me a lot. So I don't spikes can't usually kill you with your uh, damage buffers. I think is the phrase. Damage boost maybe. Ooh. Oh no. Let's do this a little slower. Alright, so this impossible uh, leap now becomes a lot easier. Perfect. Oh, and then I can just leave? Yeah, perfect. Now, what other stages? I have not defeated this stage, but there's other stages I have not got everything. Flame Mammoth, I think is... Oh, I need to power up my eyes shot. No, I think I need to defeat everything to be able to uh, power up shots. Maybe. I don't really know how you can do that. Um, so what other stage is then? I think I might have got everything except for... I'm not even sure which of these guys is which. Spark Mandrel, okay, and Flame Mammoth. Now let's just defeat the last guy then. Let's defeat the last guy and even end up winning the game and we can always go back. And also I'm on a I'm on a lookout for a extra extra area in this stage that I'm not really sure whether it exists or not. Might be a different game I'm thinking of. I guess I should stay looking up. I feel like uh, something like that might be might bring me to it. Ah, that, fe that felt like it was worth a go. You know, it felt like there could have been something up there. Taking a lot more damage than I've expected. Yeah, down here. Let me just check if uh, this is still in existence. I want to make sure I have room. Yeah, that was still still gone. Okay. What about up here, actually? I never checked up there. There it is. Okay, here we go. Here's a fight. I don't really remember anything about this fight. Alright, it doesn't look like that's damaging them. Uh, Okay, it doesn't look like it's gonna it's gonna tell me what damages them. That hurts. Oh I have to hit him in the eye. So let's go back to the storm one. But let's hit him in the eye. No. Oh. Screw this. Classic pea shooter. Alright, it looks like it's fairly simple to avoid damage by him. 
so I'm hoping it's just a matter of time. Well, it's just a matter of time before he catches me out with one of those change-ups. <laughs> I could have an energy tank, actually. No, oh, what was I thinking? That was a little stupid. Alright, he's an easy fight, though. Once we get going. Can I just farm these here? To get items? It doesn't look like it. Right, it's just gonna take a moment or two, but it shouldn't, uh, it shouldn't challenge me that much. Like the odd hit. Ah, that's a much safer way to do it. Yeah, this is... I'll just stick with this simple strategy. Like, usually a pea shooter does at least one damage. And I can't imagine a boss having more than the full meter of damage. Then again, he is smoking. That's a good sign. Bad for his health and all that. True in robots as is in humans. Come on, die! I'm liking it though, it feels like a good uh... It feels good doing this. Getting these quick hits in. Avoiding his damage. Yeah, still there. To be quite frank, I could have done that all day. Wait, what's he giving me? I've got boots, I've got a helmet. Like, what's that? Shoulder blades? <laughs> what did that do? Like, Increase my charge. Doesn't allow me to charge up other items. I don't think I'll stay around for these fights. <laughs> I just wish I could get underneath them. That. Yeah, I'm still a little curious what that item I just got was. It does. I don't think I'll need this, but first safety, sorry. Right, I'm hoping this will be a lot easier fight than the last time we tried it. I'm fairly sure this cuts him down. Cut, wood, all that. Oh, damn it. There we go. Yeah, I think you can just stay standing on the field. And, like, uh, if you get into a correct rhythm. There we go. Ah, 
Ah, there it is. Boom. No better feeling. Alright, that looks like a good spot to end the video. Um, although I do, you know what, let's not end it there. I do want to check out one more thing. Um, I want to check out... Oh, well, let's, I guess, let's see what this is going to show us. Okay, I can still go back to the old bosses, and uh, now I can go to Sigma. Alright, here's what I wanted to check out. I want to go back to the Flame Mammoth stage and see if I can get into this one last item area. But I don't know how I can jump into it. Maybe one of my new items will help. Let's just take this route. Looks a bit safer. Okay, it's all about getting up to this guy. That's what I'm... Oh! Made it! But surely that's just now harder. Yeah, I don't think... Uh, I don't think it's doable now. I think you might get one go of that and one go only. Like, ideally what I'd like to be able to do is, I think it's a nice, uh, maybe something else. What does this guy do? Yeah, I'm not able to power up any of these items yet. I think that's actually what I get when I go up there. The ability to power my items up. Okay, so we will end the video after this one thing. I think I do know how to get. If I go up here to the left. I think there's one more, um, like, I don't know, energy tank, or life, or heart, or something. Oh! Let's go ahead and use one of these cheap, cheap win items. Oh come, oh, come on, I fell down twice. That's like three times as retarded as I usually am. Yeah, do the maths on that one. All for an extra life? No, surely not. Surely not! There it is. I knew there was something over here. Problem is, I need to get over into this other spot. Right, that looks like a good spot to end the video, because I don't think I can... Uh, I can make any more inroads onto this. No. I guess what I could do is I could restart the stage, but we'll try that for another video. Thank you for watching and um, tune in next time. Tune in next time and we will take on Sigma. Sigma, I think his name was. Dr. Wiley, though, I assume is behind him somewhere. Um, yeah, let me know in the comments as well if there's any other type of games you'd like me to play. I'd certainly be up for playing some of the old, other old Mega Mans of the Xbox ones. Uh, of the, sorry, the NES games. Until then, though, thanks for watching and goodbye.